An arsonist tried to set a gay nightclub on fire, and it was all caught on video outside the club in Sarasota. Now authorities need your help to catch this guy. News Channel 8's John Rogers joins us now live in Sarasota. So, John, do authorities know if this was actually a hate crime? Good evening, Jen. Right now, authorities don't know that. But as you're about to see in the surveillance video, when this person came to the Throb nightclub, he knew exactly what he was doing. This surveillance video on Sunday morning captures a man approaching the Throb nightclub, covering his face and holding a gas can. He then poured fuel all over the front of the building. And then you can see him throwing a cigarette. Now watch. He walks away and realizes he failed. So he tries again. And with a flash, his evil deed was complete. The fire ignites toward the bottom of the screen, and smoke soon fills the air. The blaze was pretty devastating. The club owners spent 20 grand to fix it, and they're still not done. Our roll down door is now destroyed. It won't roll anymore, so we have to get a new one. That's probably going to be at least another five grand. Throb is a well known LGBT nightclub. And general manager Ronnie Barnett wants to know why someone would do this. Do you worry that this was a hate crime? Realistically, I don't know if it was or not. I would like to say I wish it wouldn't be. But the, the way the crime was done, it's just very, it's just very saddening. Authorities hope someone can recognize him. Because he's on foot, he's very comfortable in the area. He just casually walks away. It's possible he, he's familiar in the area. Was this criminal targeting the homosexual community? Authorities need to find him to learn the answer. Let's hope it wasn't, but you never know these days. There's so much going on, it's unfortunate. There is a reward out for information leading to an arrest. So if you have any information on this case, call the Sarasota County Sheriff's Office. Jen? Thank you, John Rogers, live in Sarasota for us tonight.